hey you guys i appreciate you so much for stopping here and choosing me subscribing liking commenting and sharing the content that i've been making for you guys thus far you are appreciated by me so much guys okay so let's dive in zonza child okay what is it that really makes you sick whether you are sick mentally emotionally physically it doesn't matter guys what is it that really causes the suffering the suffering is caused by the energy within you the energy that you carry guys is way too strong way too heavy for just an individual to handle okay so as a influencer chat it simply means that you are here by purpose there is a purpose that maybe you really need to serve here on this plane okay so once you don't use or make use of that purpose or you don't live up to your purpose that's when the real suffering will start okay because now the energy gets blocked within you it is over of, of you because you are not mobilizing it so that's exactly what causes the suffering it is the energy itself okay so like everything will, will, will be painful in your body simply because the energy now is consuming you okay so the main thing is for you to actually identify your soul motion. What is it that you are here for? What is it that you should uh, be focusing on, guys, with the help of your own spirit guides? So this is where you come in, where you ask your own spirit guides, what is it that is meant for me? So they will come in many ways, shape or form, to, to communicate with you as to which path should you follow. Because not all of us are meant to to heal as in like in a in, in a healing facility as in like for some of you yeah it can be that maybe you are meant to sing that's how you will heal that's how um your healing is you're supposed to sing okay and people will hear through your voice by hearing your voice you will heal many people for some of you can be an artist you know using your hands or whatever that is okay because we differ from person to person for some of you you meant to dance okay so that's why your body will be so much in pain because you are not uh, making use of your body you know as an soul as a child you are more active than any any person that is just living a normal life guys okay so once you realize that you are not normal the better it will get for you okay so it, it is more like you're supposed to you are that person who's always in a movement you should always be doing something for 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 the embetterment of other people you understand what i'm saying so mainly if you're not doing anything the energy consumes you either you will lose weight immensely because you're not doing anything you will get sick physically your your body will ache your bones will be painful your head will, will, will it's all bomb at all because you have so much knowledge going on in your head so much info and once you don't share that info it eats off of you that's why the headache that's why the migraines that's why my power it's because of that inner knowing and you are not sharing it okay so once you are not sharing it this will turn into something nasty something ugly because you are aware and you do have the ability to see to foresee but you are not utilizing that energy the correct way so this is where now you become this judgmental person you judge everything that everybody is doing because you know better but you're not doing it you're not doing anything about it you understand what i'm saying so this is you now you become judgmental you judge everything you judge everyone um just to make yourself feel better okay and this is because from your house of hearts you know what is right you know how things should be done but you're not doing anything about it that's an issue and because you're not doing anything similarly what can you say about it nothing okay so you tend to know better but you're not doing anything so you might literally come across someone doing something exactly that your own spirit guides have told you to do but you did not and that person is doing it and maybe they're doing it not in the true sense of the word or maybe you know you can do better and this will make you nasty okay so that's why you will tend to get um most water kids are, 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 are more aggressive are more angry are more sad are more uh, they turn out to be even jealous so to speak okay or competitive so to speak um because uh 
they know that you know what i can do better or i know exactly how this is being done but i'm not doing it you, you understand so why not utilize the energy by doing the right thing do exactly what is expected to do be the light that you meant to be instead of judging those who are trying their level best to and better their lives okay that's exactly what i mean and the more you do that the more you suffer you understand so that's exactly where the suffering comes from so emotionally you won't be okay because automatically you see yourself as a failure automatically you see yourself as, as someone who who is not uh, capable of doing something or you 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 see you belittle yourself as in like oh some people are better because at least they can take that leap of faith at least they can take that first step now here grows it becomes something huge now you, you now you can't sleep at night because of the fear now it's becoming something else it haunts you now you, you understand so the more that happens the more your own spirit guys get angry now it, bec it becomes something bigger and then the suffering becomes even worse okay it becomes even worse so similarly it's more like when you go to someone you'll you be like okay um i want to consult because you go to consult already knowing the answers or already knowing what the other person is going to say so what's the point are you are you are, are you are you testing that person or are you testing your own spirit guides you understand so the, the, the minute you start being true to yourself by accepting by knowing that i know and i know that i can do it myself because the only way you can change the world is through you you can't change the world the world it is what it is so you change yourself live your truth people will follow suit those who are actually in alignment with you will definitely follow suit okay your tribe will definitely find you you don't have to go in search or or anything like that people will follow you those who are kind of like um familiar with your spirits because we recognize each other by spirits okay so hence i'm saying try your best do your best when your guides are kind of like giving you that blueprint as in like this is what you should be doing try and do your best and don't be afraid of failure because that's exactly how you grow okay you fail once you fail they will come back and say no this is not how we do it this is how we do it and this is how you grow you accept that oh so this is where i fumbled now you correct yourself you move forward the more you learn the the better you become and then you that's how you heal guys there is no magic there is no um so that that's what exactly will cause you to be impatient with yourself because you expect things to happen by themselves and that's not exactly how things happen here okay you communicate firstly you communicate say you pray you meditate and everything so you set intentions what is it that you want to achieve first because you can't just pray and, and expect things to happen without you doing anything okay exactly so you 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 focus as to what is it that really makes your soul happy regardless of what other people will say okay just satisfy the soul the world will definitely adjust okay so you do exactly what the soul wants and once your soul is correct your life will become better for sure you will definitely feel better for sure whether mentally physically emotionally guys you will definitely be okay one day at a time because nothing really happens in a jiffy especially if you are on a spiritual path remember that being spiritual doesn't mean that you know everything it simply means that um spiritual is being spiritual it simply means that um the ability to think for yourself that's what we call spirituality okay spirituality is the ability to think for yourself so this is you now you becoming spiritual you are able to think for yourself and once you realize your mistakes you work on them you move forward that's what you call maturity then okay so you don't you you, you don't feel for feel sorry for yourself and now um take a, a step back and be like oh no so the world would judge me so what okay so what let them judge the more they judge you the the, the, the powerful you become the, the the more better you will become okay because these people are more like now your blueprint because they make you um aware of your mistakes as in what is it that you really need to fix okay so this is more like a it works in your favor anyway so everything that happens here it, 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 it's it's for your own embetterment whether good or bad sometimes yeah you will not feel uh, okay sometimes you won't feel good because maybe because of the circumstances or your surroundings well otherwise it is still okay not every day will be you know like 
glorious as in like that guys okay so once you master this this will definitely um, help you emotionally physically mentally especially when it comes to the people uh, that you deal with people will, will definitely try to bring you down or I don't know guys you know like literally you don't have to focus on them focus on the soul focus on the mission okay it will definitely slow your progress or make you feel down a little but once that happens try and meditate and also remember the mission okay remember the mission so the easier it will get for you guys okay because the more raised you become remember that you are that person who's not supposed to be raised by how people act towards you or whatever the case might be okay so once you 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 try and control your emotions as much as you can as much as you can this will definitely work for you because remember that you are fire and water but then fire is less water is more on you okay once you allow yourself to always be angry always um be raised by people places and things okay you lower that water level of yours remember that nagano is to form so this is how you fall from grace okay by allowing your circumstances to become you okay so never allow that try and find balance in between guys okay especially emotionally so to speak all right so that you can balance the scale okay so i really hope the video finds you well guys and it is somehow helpful to some of you i appreciate you so much until then from me to you guys i'm sending you love and light you take care bye bye